So, a couple of months back I announced that I had signed a contract for a new book that um, this time it wasn't going to be a compendium, but it was going to be a pretty close relative of one. Um, at the time I didn't announce the topic of the book, uh, for reasons I've forgotten now, uh, so I thought I'd go ahead and announce that. But not for any kind of marketing reasons. The book isn't going to be out till long after you and I are both dead. Um, fall of 2014 is that date by the way. Instead, I kind of want to tell everybody because, uh, well, so I can be less cagey about um, what I'm visiting. Uh, for the past six months, I've been to some really cool sites and I wanted to post it on Otis uh, or the Facebook page or Twitter. And I've had to help hold back just because, you know, I had kept the book project under wraps. Um, but this all makes way more sense if you uh, know what I'm talking about. Uh, so here you go. Edgar Allan Feinstein. Uh, it's a book about Poe. Um, it's going to be a weird book about Poe, um, which is good. Uh, ideally, it'll be a different kind of Poe book. There's millions out there, and this one has to stand out, I'm told, by my publisher and editor and everybody else. Uh, so what I've been doing is uh, visiting sites and artifacts and memorials related to Poe from north of Boston all the way down to South Carolina. And ideally, hopefully, um, even beyond that, uh, we'll see. So I'm basically just living and traveling Poe for an entire year, uh, realizing dreams no mortal ever dared to dream before. So like the Grapendiums, it's a travelogue of my experiences doing that. Uh, what I see, my opinions of them, um, how to get there. But uh, unlike the Grapendiums, it's not one topic, obviously, uh, multiple states, and it's more of a narrative book. Instead of it being you know, individual entries like the Grapendiums were, it's gonna be one long story, uh, one long interesting story um, about Poe's physical legacy. It's also going to be a very social book. I'm talk talking to a lot of people, um, museum managers, collectors, um, uh, just people that are extremely knowledgeable about Poe. So I'll be, <laughs> be terrified to be doing a lot of misquoting in this book, obviously. The things I've done and seen so far, I've, you know, as a Poe fan myself, have really blown my mind. And the stuff that's on my slate still to see over the next six months, um, I'm gonna have to, you know, reinflate my mind to have it blown again because there's just so many amazing things that we still have uh, connected to Poe and so many good stories behind them. So here's to Poe. Here's to another book. Um, here's to hoping you guys are as gracious with this book as you have been with the past two that I've written. And um, that's it. I'm really excited for you guys to read this when it gets done. So I should probably start writing it actually instead of just traveling to places. <laughs>